Hello and welcome to the next episode of my photography vlog and today I've travelled to the Copper Coast on um, the southern coast of Ireland close to Waterford and I've come to a beach called Benvoy and Benvoy is a phenomenally beautiful beach. Uh, in fact all the beaches along this whole area are outstanding and mainly because of the amount of sea stacks that are uh, situated around here and I've arrived here now around about maybe 45 minutes before sunset and already the light is becoming uh, pretty nice pretty intense I'll swing around and give you a look here um, at what I'm seeing so you can see here that the Sun uh, is just breaking through a bit of cloud here and the uh, waves are coming in here below me and then just over here as well I have one of these uh, stacks now the tide is out and uh, tide will be coming back in um, so I'm going to shoot here uh, coming in and going to try and do something uh, today which is get down low and get down close to the water so you can see uh, a different viewpoint uh, when I take my shots instead of actually having the tripod up at a normal height that you normally take your shots I'm going to get down low and we'll see how those uh, shots will turn out but I do think I'm going to be rewarded the sky even though it is grey there is a gap right on the edge of the uh, horizon here as you can see and uh, hopefully that sun uh, which is already giving a glow will really break through on that and light up the clouds that you see that are currently dark and grey above me at the moment so looks promising going to get cracking on and I'll take a couple of shots So as you can see uh, I am down quite low here and the idea is to um, get as much as close to the action as I possibly can because the way the water is moving around me here I've got a couple of rocks with some uh, barnacles some seaweed and such like that in front of me as I mentioned as well because the uh, tide is out um, it's not really going to be uh, perfect timing for the sea stacks so I'm looking for some uh, differences along the, um, the water line itself and there's some rocks here and the water is coming in around me and when it's coming in around me here uh, like I would have done on a previous episode to show the difference between a half a second a one second uh, one and a half second exposures if you haven't seen that I link to it uh, here but um, what I'm trying to do is again keep the movement in the water uh, keep the shot as well kind of make you feel as if you're part of the landscape or the seascape and when the water will come through it's sweeping around me at the moment so it'll give me a nice backwash as well uh, out over these rocks here and um, there is a small bit of color already on the horizon there is a gap on the clouds right on the horizon as well so I'm still keeping my fingers crossed that that will work and um, that the Sun will be able to break through that gap right at sunset and it should light things up here and there is a small bit of a glow as well appearing um, just above the horizon the gap in those clouds but for the most part it is quite uh, gray but there are um, pockets of color starting to show themselves around here so um, just a very simple uh, setup here um, I'm going to play around as well just maybe try and isolate one or two rocks because there's one or two that I don't really like here um, but it's a good start and it's a good idea then as well from the different flow that you'll see of the uh, water when it flows in and out Okay, so in keeping it getting down low, what I want to try and do here is show when the water is going out, like I would have done in the previous episodes, uh, that it gives you a completely different look and feel. So, the um, not going to get any color. Uh, looking at the sky here, uh, the color seems to have um, been killed by the clouds. But as you can see here, there's the stack that's over here, and then as the water comes through, um, it's coming up just as far as where I am right now, and that's giving me. Um, a lovely shot because as the water goes back out again it uh, creates a lovely outgoing feel to the image leads your eye right to the stack that we're seeing behind here so I've got a wave now just just coming around my feet as you can see here and I just wait and catch now and then I'll be able to catch all that movement as the water is going out and it gives a uh, lovely look and feel to the uh, image so um, a short uh, episode of my vlog today just to show getting down low and getting close to the water and um, I'm going to continue to take a couple of shots here now because I might get a small bit of blue in the blue hour but we'll see how that goes but yeah from a uh, area of Benvoy on the Copper Coast 
Uh, thanks very much for uh, watching this episode. And again, as always, if you do enjoy the content on this channel, please do hit the uh, subscribe button and that little bell. And I look forward now to getting back to process my images and see what I get from uh, shooting here today.